Hello, I'm Ziv Daniel Hajbi, Director of Product Management here at Zenity and a leader of the OWASP Group for Local Network Security. And today, we're diving into how citizen developers like you can leverage OWASP security guidelines to build secure apps. OWASP always strives to stay at the cutting edge of technologies and trends, and recently released the OWASP Top 10 Guidelines for Citizen Developers. This is, of course, a testimony for how large and critical citizen development has become in organizations. So why is security important for citizen developers? As local no code tools and Gen AI platforms empower non technical users to build apps, understanding and implementing security best practices becomes crucial to protect your data and systems from threats. As shown, apps built by citizen developers can have the same vulnerabilities as apps built by pro developers. However, the risk is even greater as business users are the actual users who drive the business in an organization. Thus, they have access to critical business data as a part of their job requirements. Hence, a mistake for a citizen developer could easily lead to data leakage of business and critical data. These apps have the capacity to process highly critical and sensitive information in the form of PII, PHI, and PCI. They can easily be overshared with guest user uh, users with the entire tenant. Yeah indirectly or directly. They can easily leak data natively as built-in templates. And classically, to any application security, they handle secrets and can expose them in, clear, in, in plain text. All of which is, of course, common to classic and traditional application security. Citizen development happens anywhere, from big to small organizations, and it's spread across many platforms. The same risks repeat themselves in different platforms like Microsoft Power Platform, Salesforce, and others. For that reason, the OWASP for low-code, no-code exists. It's here to provide the necessary knowledge and know-how to help citizen developers build secure applications. It groups the different types of risks and boils them down in layman's terms so non-security professionals can read and understand what is the risk and how to avoid it. So what now? Starting with security in mind is easier than you think. Begin by familiarizing yourself with OWASP resources, applying basic security best practices, and staying updated on the latest security trends. In addition to reviewing the OWASP for local no code, join the community and make an impact. You can use Slack, GitHub, or any of the groups uh, mentioned here to join uh, the citizen development security wave. There are also recording in place. Um, they will walk you through common mistakes that business users are commonly uh, are making when building uh, business applications. Thank you for watching. And remember, securing your application is a continuous process. Visit OWASP website to learn more and join our community to stay ahead in the security game.